<laughs> Why, Patricia, make bouquet of flowers? It's for Gilbert. Because, oh, you know. Mm, no, Miguel not know. To show him I love him. Don't you have a sweetheart, Miguel? <laughs> yes, Miguel have many girlfriends. Miguel girlfriends, yellow and sweet. Miguel girlfriends, grow on trees. Miguel really love bananas. <laughs> I knew you were a true romantic, Miguel. <laughs> Miguel love you more than Tumpy, Tumpy, Tumpy. Miguel love you so much that Miguel could conjugate. Miguel loved you. Miguel love you. Miguel will love you. Bravo, Miguel. I think that's charming. He wrote her a poem? She thinks it's charming? <gasps> you okay, Gilbert? Yes, oh. I'm fine! How could they do this to me? Uh, Miguel? Uh, 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 friends, duty calls! Huh? The Jungle Bunch! To the, to the rescue! rescue. <laughs> Gilbert, huh? Uh. What's wrong? Never mind, it's just Gilbert. So, where was I? Ah, yes, the Jungle Bunch to the rescue! rescue. Great, Great mission. mission! And open. Oh, hello, Marla. Hi, Roger. So, friends, what brings you to this part of the world? Well, Great Warrior Tiger, Roger and I, we've gotten into the habit of swapping plants and seeds for our plantations. Uh, Marla takes the weird plants, and I take the carrots, potatoes, zucchini, pumpkins, turnips, peppers... Yeah, vegetables, I got it. Exactly right, vegetables. The last time we swapped seeds, there was a misstep. A terribly bad misstep, actually. We mixed up carrot seeds and carnivorous plant seeds. I planted some all over the rabbit's area. We realized the error when we found carrots where carnivorous plants should have been. Yes, so? Well, by now, lots of carnivorous plants must be growing in the rabbit's warren. Quite a misstep. Then we're gonna have to save the rabbits. What type of carnivorous plant is it, Marla? The very worst type. There are two very important rules to respect when you grow them. Never water them or they'll multiply. And never give them fertilizer. They would grow larger and very aggressive. Yeah, great. But how do we get rid of them? Well, the easiest is to set fire to them. Carnivorous plants burn well. That said, be careful. I may have planted explosive mushrooms without meaning to, so uh, no missteps or it blows up. Okay, fine. Come on, let's set off for the rabbit's warren, friends. Grumpy Mouse, not one bouquet of flowers. Yes, he's very grumpy today. What's that? Don't change your plans on my account. Huh? Careful, Miguel. Be very careful. Huh? Huh? Happy anniversary to you. Thank you all. Your mother and I were so happy to be able to celebrate our wedding anniversary with our beloved children, who we love so much. Even if I get a little mixed up with your names. Sorry to interrupt the party, gift. rabbits, but you have to come with us. You're in danger here. We're what? There are carnivorous plants growing in the area. You have to leave. Oh, no, not before you've opened the gift. Open, open the gift. gift. Open the open gift. gift. Wait a minute. Gift. All we have to do is vote. Who is in favor of leaving the warren before we open the gift? Hmm. And who's against? Hi! So, Hi. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 42, 43, 45, 60, 69, 70, 71, 72, let's see, 93, 94, and with little Gordon, 95! And with us too. 97! Uh, okay, that makes five in favor and 97 against. We're staying! <laughs> If little Wabbits not listen to Mr. Maurice, Miguel Thump Wabbits. Mm. Ah, disgusting. Yes, yeah, so I'm in our family. When we're feeling extremely stressed out, we have a tendency to go number two. Uh. Hey, Miguel. Mm -hmm. You think I'm gonna let you go after small, defenseless animals? You don't know me. Come on, defend yourself. I'm not kidding. I'm striking the post! Okay, Gilbert, enough silliness. We're not gonna waste any more time with these rabbits. If they won't move, we'll try to find all the plants as fast as possible. Hmm. They weren't planted that long ago, so they must still be small. Oh no, rain! If the plants get wet, it's gonna be... A catastrophe! Come on, let's hurry up! You're running away! You're scared, right? Patricia, I'll check over there. Are you coming with me? No, it's best we're not together, Gilbert. 
Not together? Really? Of course. Going our separate ways is best. Good luck! Let go! Don't worry! I'll get you out! Thanks, but what is that thing? This is supposed to be a carrot patch. I'll get rid of them. In the meantime, don't go near it. As long as you don't water or feed it, it won't hurt us. Save little rabbit, but Miguel cannot dump nasty mushrooms that go boom. Hmm. Miguel have idea. <laughs> little rabbit cling to branch, and Miguel lift you out. <laughs> Come on now, Miguel. Drop your stick. We'll settle this like primates. You gonna run away again? Um, Miguel busy right now. You traitor! I'm gonna put you through the lizard treatment. Kick, 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 kick. I got you, my friend. Uh, if you could settle this later, I would appreciate it. Junior, do you see all this poop? If a plant eats that, it'll get really huge. Hmm. It seems this one got plenty of fertilizer. Open that gift! Open that gift! Open that gift! Oh, thank you, children! A pool! <laughs> wow, a swimming pool with water. Oh, my goodness! Get away! Leave now! If these roots touch the water, carnivorous plants are going to multiply! They'll be everywhere! No, Maurice! Don't stress them out! What do you mean? I have to warn them. Huh? Plot thickens. Hmm? Oh, no, 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 no. If the roots reach the pool, we're done for. Come on. Right. Huh? Huh? Oh, Miguel, go help little rabbits. Here, take this. 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 Huh? Huh? Where is he? <laughs> Patricia, hold tight. Miguel coming. Dumpy, dumpy, dumpy. <sighs> okay, I get it. I'm bowing out. How are we going to get rid of this horror? Good idea, son. Hey, Gordon, go and get the anniversary cake. My name isn't Gordon, it's Jordan. Actually, I'm Gordon. <laughs> There are lots of candles because we each put one on. Great. Thanks, Gordon. No, no, I'm Jordan. Thank you, Jungle Boy. Oh, Thank you. Oh, through. I'm going to deal with this plant. Maybe I won't come back alive, but it's no big deal anyway. No one's gonna miss me. Farewell, Patricia! I won't bother you anymore. I have no right to prevent you from being happy. I hope you find happiness without me! Albert, watch out! Okay, where is that plan? Oh, no! Patricia, you saved me! 
So you do care for me? Hmm? But of course, silly. <laughs> Goodbye, rabbits. Happy anniversary. Goodbye, the Jungle Bunch. What do you say to the Jungle Bunch for saving all of us children? Thank you, the Jungle Bunch. Thank you, the Jungle Bunch. Thank you, the Jungle Bunch. Some girl not too sad? You just don't measure up. She's not your sweetheart. She's mine. Miguel no understand. Gilbert love banana too. Mm -hmm. Ah, a gorgeous day, isn't it, son? You see, Junior, a great warrior tiger doesn't need much to be happy. Kung fu, justice, great training, and... That's great, Patricia. Mm -hmm. Well done. <laughs> what? Wait, Mom, what are you doing? I was in the neighborhood, so I thought I'd teach them the secret of a great dragon's broom move. But, Mom, I'm the one who's supposed to handle training. Besides, the dragon's broom is a lame technique. It doesn't work. Oops, sorry, Maurice. You were saying, Manu? Wait, I wasn't even ready. It doesn't count. She just snuck up on me. Is that what you teach my team when I'm away to sneak up on people? Nice one, Mom. But I didn't do it on purpose. You're the one who threw yourself under my broom. You've got to be careful. Anyway, it's always the same with you. It's never enough. Miguel did Mr. Maurice. If Mom of Miguel thump instead of Miguel, Miguel's sad. Thanks, Miguel. Mm -hmm. Finally, someone who gets me. I will never take your place and thump baddies. Promise. Thanks, Mr. Maurice. You're welcome, Miguel. You understand. Uh... What were we talking about? We were talking about you being taken down by a teeny tiny dragon's broom. Granted, it was a surprise. What do you mean? He ran into my foot, and my broom is not tiny. Uh, no, that's not what I meant. Actually, I think I see exactly what you, you mean. You see what happens when you decide my to handle my training for me? So now it's my fault? Look, mm. Patricia, all I'm saying is that you have to I'm be careful. I'm training the team, Mom. You, I didn't do it on purpose. Miguel prefers to thump. When Miguel thump, at least nobody argue. I'm really fed up with grown-ups. My daddy and my granddad are always arguing. That's it. Give me back my lemons. They were neatly lined up in my hut. It had to be you. But I don't even like lemons. What would I do with them? However, some of my kiwis are missing. You're the one who stole them. Ah! I've had it with all grown-ups. Son? Hey, Junior? Junior, where'd you go? My little tiger, where are you? Yoo-hoo! Junior! You know what? You're so right. I'm sick of listening to them fight as well. You wanna leave? <laughs> you can't catch me, Junior! Come on, Junior, you're a tiger! Catch me! Great day. Look at all these lemons and kiwis. The groundhogs never suspected. Theophile, go put that behind the counter for me. Yes, Mom. Theodore, put this one with the others over there. Okay, Mom. It's a super great plan, Mom. With everything we've stolen across the jungle, we've filled up our reserves. I think you're right, Junior. And she must be the chief. Nasty thieves. Mm -hmm. That's why my daddy always fights with my grandpa. Mm -hmm. We gotta warn your daddy. We can't let these baddies get away with this. What is it, Junior? <gasps> hey, Mom! There's a little tiger and a groundhog who want to tell on us! Wait, Junior! Let's run! What? What do I do? Stop them before they get away! Okay, Mom! You shall not pass! <laughs> what are you still doing here? Come back here! <laughs> Open up! Open up! You won't get away! Open the door! You're surrounded! Oh, we're done for, Junior! How do we get away from them? Huh? You 
really think we can go through here? Geronimo! What are you waiting for? Catch them! But, Mom, they're locked in and they don't want to open up! He's right. Fools, we're moles! Use your hands and dig! Wow. Look, Junior. That's how they steal fruit from everyone. They dig tunnels under the whole jungle. That's why my grandpa and my daddy never noticed. Wow, looks enormous. Quick, let's see where it leads. <laughs> That's it, got him! Well, thank you, Junior! Well, I used to have him. Are they gonna stop running or what? Mom, this just isn't fair! They went to the left! Um, which left? Uh, this left? No, this left! I'm surrounded by incompetence! Ah, <sighs> the end of the tunnel. Thieves, what kids think of these days? Ah! Mom, I got him. Actually, it's not a tiger. <laughs> That's it. I got it. I'm going to test something, Junior. You'll see. That's it. This time I got him. Oh no, just a rock. See that? They seem to locate us by the ground's vibrations. Every time we set foot on the ground, they'll be able to catch us. How are we ever going to escape, Junior? Junior! Junior! Oh, Junior! Hello? Lola! 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 Oh, hello there. Have you guys seen Lola? Afraid not. We're looking for my son. What's that? You stole my lemons? No, Grandpa, he said son, not lemon. They must be playing together somewhere. What if we searched for them together? What can we possibly do, Junior? Of course you're right! It's a great idea! Ready, Junior? Steady? Let's roll! Done for, kid. As long as I hear you walk, I'll find you anywhere. And here you are. Huh? Where did she go? How about up here? Uh, 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 hey, you're up, Junior. You got Theophil and Theodule, but you're not going to get me so easily, you fools! I'm borrowing it! Okay, but I want it back, kid. You won't escape, little twerp! <laughs> Oh, thank you, kids. You have a great day. Ah, Junior, finally. Lola, here you are. Where were you, my little tiger? We've been looking for you for hours. You won't believe this. We couldn't stand listening to you fight, so we went off to play and we came upon a family of mole thieves. 
They're the ones who stole all the fruit, so you don't have to argue anymore. Okay, kids. I promise that we won't fight anymore. And you're going to stop teaching Kung Fu in my place. Yes, Maurice. You're right. It was silly. We're going to stop fighting, I promise. Yeah, you haven't heard the last of me! But wasn't that a dragon's broom you just did there? The move that's supposed to be so lame? Uh, yes, but it wasn't the broom that made her fall. She seemed to just slip. No, 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 no. It was a real dragon's broom. Ugh. What's that? I heard what you said. You said lemons, so you're the thief. But Grandpa, he said dragon broom. He didn't say lemon. Calm down. I settled it all. Huh? What do you mean you swallowed it all? So you're the thief. Mm -hmm. Just stop, Grandpa. I'm sure it's him. <gasps> They're at it again. Well, Shall we go? go? I don't like the look in your eyes. Hey, my mother is not a cheat. She can eat, but not my lemons. Come on, Grandpa. Let's go home. You got me. Well done, my little tiger. You are getting better and better. Hello, Natasha. It's been a long time. What brings you here? My grandson came to spend his vacation with me. Junior, come and say hi to Granny's neighbor. It's the famous tiger of the Jungle Bunch. Your granny talks about you all the time. My junior stopped a tornado. My junior beat a group of elephants. <laughs> I was on vacation in a lovely village run by four ladies. It was so relaxing. I really enjoyed it, but you probably wouldn't like it. And why wouldn't I? I was trying to think what we could do with Junior that could be interesting. Please, Natasha. We know what you tigers are like. You like to put out volcanoes, to prevent earthquakes, and to stop bad guys. But the village I'm talking about is for ordinary people, who enjoy the peace and quiet, and who like to make jam. It's kind of like for people who are normal. I don't want to bother you any longer. Have fun, you two. Just who exactly does she think she is? We would fit in perfectly fine there. We'll show her we're normal. Let's go, little tiger. We'll have a normal vacation, and it's going to be normal. Someone's here! Someone's here! Someone's here! What is it? Hello. My grandson and I would like to vacation here for a few days. Oh, but of course. This is a peaceful and serene hideaway. The perfect place to spend some family time. Come with me, I'll show you around. Myself included, four of us ladies actually run this village together. And don't worry, fun is also part of our daily life. We have a whole variety of activities to offer. Now, there's just one small detail. Silence and discipline at all times are sacred to us. For every transgression, the culprit will get a sticker. If by misfortune someone gets five stickers, he will then lose all his privileges, and the sanction will be terrible. Ah, herbal tea workshop time. Follow me, please. Excuse me, could you please show us where we can huh? rest a little first? Uh, we would like to... But it's time for the workshop. You can't miss the herbal tea workshop on the first day. It's great for your health. Now, now, come on, follow me. To make a nice herbal tea, you need to put some chamomile in boiling water. But be careful, this chamomile is very powerful. Everything in life should be measured. Now your turn. No, it can't be that complicated. We're starting to feel the effect of chamomile. Isn't it great? Hmm? But... What? Did you put too much chamomile? Mm -mm. Yes, too much chamomile. Come closer. That's with a sticker. <sighs> Using too much chamomile can put everyone to sleep. <sighs> <sighs> Mm. 
guava, guava. One whole guava. A guava a day will keep the doctor away. <laughs> can't oh, I can't believe it. Too loud. You deserve a sticker. Knitting is the art of patience and persistence. Oh, that's worth a sticker. The most important thing in making jam is to pay attention to the cooking time. Uh, I think my jam is no good. Fabian, <laughs> stop clowning around. Come on, everyone. I'm Fabian. I'm jam. on vacation with my grandpa. Sorry. Let it stick Hi, Junior. Uh, oh, don't worry. I make a bunch of mistakes, too. These grandmas aren't so nice when we don't do exactly as we're told. When I grow up, I'll do whatever I want. What do you want to do when you grow up? Awesome! What a nice job, Tiger Warrior! I can't believe it. Uh, Fabian, what did we say about chatting during the workshop? That makes a fifth sticker for you, so you are done. We'll have a long discussion about your behavior. But that's it for today. Now go back to your family. I'm sorry, Junior. This isn't really a dream vacation, is it? I really thought we could adapt, you know, like everyone. Come on, Junior. Let's go to sleep. We have an early bridge game workshop in the morning. Well, well, Tiger family. Still awake at this hour, I see. We have rules here, my dear Tigers, and breaking those rules implies sanctions. When it's time to sleep, we sleep. You can understand that, I'm sure. Now then, go to bed. Excuse me, ma'am, you're not setting a good example for your grandson. You don't scare me. There, you earned a new sticker. You deserve it. Fabian? Who are you talking about? There's never been any Fabian here. No, Junior, we're not going to suspect people for no reason. We're on vacation. Try to relax, my little tiger. And now let's sleep. Tigers are asking questions. We have to be careful. Calm down, my friends. Despite the tigers, we can't forget our goal. Spreading our manners across the whole jungle. And where do the bad seeds that don't adapt to our way of life go? To the workshop! To the workshop! Go back we'll to bed. Them leave tomorrow. If they resist, we... What is that? <sighs> okay, Junior, but we'll attack together on three. One, two, three. Huh? Where, where are they? Bad in sewing. Can't prepare an herbal tea to name a few. You really are the worst grandma we have ever met. No need to enjoy sewing to be a grandmother. Oh, <gasps> that's it. This little speech of yours is worth a fifth sticker. You deserve it. And where do five sticker people go? To the workshop. Our little tigers are waking up. You're finally going to be useful. <laughs> but where are we? In the workshop. I'd say that your stay is going to take a new turn. You are using slaves to build weapons? Who do you think we are? You will be making jam, covers, and herbal tea, so everyone knows there's no better way to live than our quiet and reasonable approach. We'll rule over a jungle that's quiet and normal. I've met my fair share of crazy meanies, but that's a new one. Hi, Junior. I got you too. We have to work for them here and make everything they want. I got five stickers on the first morning. That was a big mistake. What can we do? We're not escape artists. We are. Where is the 
the little tiger. Don't count on me to help with that. Hmm. I'll admit, you are rather good in a staring contest, but you'll fall in line too, like the rest. But what is... Ah! Oh. Hey, what's going on in here? The tigers are loose! It's time to close the workshop. Okay, fine, we'll close the workshop. Bye, Junior, and thank you! <laughs> that wasn't exactly the vacation I pictured. You'll come back and spend time with me again? I guess it wasn't that bad for a tiger vacation. Everyone's gone! Everyone's gone! So then we kidnap the king, and then we tell everyone in the village he's retired, and bam, I take his place and become the new Mandrill King. So, is that a plan or what? Uh, I said, or what? Uh, yeah, I think that's a great plan. Especially the part when I said, that's a great plan. Uh, but I didn't understand the plan part. Could you explain it again? Okay, for the last time. There, you see these four mandrels? That's us. I'll even draw my turban. He draws really good. Yeah, you can tell what it is right away. Shh, focus. That's the mandrel king. You'll know him by his crown. Every day the king goes on a walk around the beaver pond. So we dress up as beavers and wait for him on the other side. When he passes by, we kidnap him, lock him in a box, and then we'll send him to the other side of the world. Then we'll tell the village that he's retired and bam, I take his place and I become the new king of the Mandros! Oh, see, when it's drawn like that, it's a lot easier to understand. One thing, is the king okay with being kidnapped? Ugh. The king doesn't know about our plan. That's how kidnappings work. Yeah, 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 yeah. If you don't get it, just say so. First, any of you know what a kidnapping is? Uh, a short sleep in the afternoon? No, that's napping. We've gone over this for hours, and you don't even know what kidnapping means? Uh, sir, can a stone move by itself? Huh? Since when do stones move by themselves? <laughs> That's not a stone! He knows our plan! If the king talks to that elephant, we're finished! Let's get him! Not damn Marie, during your brief absence, I will do my best to shoulder the responsibilities that usually fall upon you. No, 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 that's too formal. Don't worry, Maurice. When you're gone, I'll handle everything. Yeah, that's not bad. Gilbert, <laughs> Maurice and Junior are leaving now. Don't you want to say goodbye? Yes, yes, I'm coming. Are you ready, Junior? Well, then we're good to go. All right. Ready to leave for your little tiger vacation? Yes, a survival weekend in the most dangerous places of the jungle. It's going to be great. See you soon. Uh, Maurice? I don't want to delay you, but don't you think you should maybe name a new head of the jungle bunch while you're gone? Mm-hmm. Not a bad idea, Gilbert. So the new temporary leader of the jungle bunch is... Hmm... Hmm... <laughs> Patricia. All right, see ya. Ciao. Patricia, now great tiger warrior. Well, congratulations, Patricia. Thank you, Gilbert. I don't have the experience that Maurice has, but I'll try to replace him the best I can my own way. Your own way? What do you mean? Are you going to change the way things are done? But, Patricia, habits are important. They're even vital. Without them, we have random acts, improvisation, uh, and chaos. Hello, Jungle Bunch. I'm Ronald. 
And I need your help. Calm down. Breathe deep. You're safe here. You seem a little stressed. Not to mention just showing up like that, not even using the signal, and we're supposed to find that normal? I'm so sorry. But I'm being chased by a group of mandrels. I don't know what they want from me. I only know that they're planning a dirty trick on the mandrel king. I'm guessing they didn't like that I overheard him talking about it. Um, can you turn around for a second, please? I think I might have to deal with this. It looks like a detailed map of the kidnapping plans. I'm guessing they want to make sure that no matter what, the Mandrel King doesn't see it. Oh yeah? Oh, then we just have to erase the drawing and all is good, right? But we can't do that. This drawing is important evidence. We need to escort you to the Mandrel King to show him. He has to know that somebody is trying to kidnap him. A main guy who drew a Machiavellian plan on an elephant. A mission starting at the pond. I have a bad feeling about this. Don't worry, nothing will happen to you while you're with the Jungle Bunch. Uh, okay, all right. I trust you. Uh, I'll follow you. <laughs> the elephant's protected by the bunch. That changes things. We need a new plan. Hey, guys, I think that if we do this... Oh, yeah. That's great. <laughs> Sir, I think we have an awesome plan to catch him. Y you actually have a plan? Let's be on alert. We don't know what ingenious means they'll use to try and catch us. <laughs> That was far. Miguel, can you take care of them? <laughs> yes! <laughs> the bee! The bee! The bee! Okay, let's go. It should be fine now. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. From now on, just let me handle all the plans? Okay. <laughs> Shade, do you want me to get sunburned? Come on, go away. <laughs> Ronald, we're almost at the King's. You must be relieved. Ronald, where did he go? Hmm, peanuts. Interesting. And we killed some banana. <laughs> Wait a second! <gasps> the mandrel are trying to trap him! We have to stop them! <laughs> Ronald, you have to stop! The mandrels have set a trap! Well, I can't! Peanuts are so good! It's not my fault, I love them so much! Big elephant like food, Mikel understands. Mikel has the same problem with bananas, but Mikel has solution now to stop falling in traps. When Mikel no eat banana during one whole day, Mikel then let Mikel eat two bananas next day. That's quite clever. Uh, but if you don't mind, I think I still prefer to continue eating them today. Mikel warning! Mikel not move! Could you scoot over? I just need one or two more. No, 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 no! Miguel, not move! <laughs> uh, uh, well, okay. Well, I'm just gonna follow you then. Can I eat just one last one? <laughs> no, okay, okay, I'm following you. Oh no! I don't get it! Why didn't it work? We picked tons of peanuts and elephants love to eat peanuts! Oh, why? Tons of peanuts! What a treat! <laughs> <laughs> Patricia, Maurice would have said it's a bit of a trek. That's true, Gilbert. Maurice would have said that. Then I'll say it. It's a bit of a trek. You know, Patricia, this leader role really suits you. Really? You think so? Yes, I really think so. Uh -huh. Uh 
What's this? No more fighting. Looks like they want to make peace. So then you admit that you have behaved badly? You don't want to take on Ronald anymore? And the Mandrill King? You really want to apologize? Oh no, they're gonna erase the joy! Yeah! I beat the bus! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. So am I the boss or am I the boss? Yeah! I'm gonna be the king, yeah! I'm gonna be the king, yeah! I'm gonna be the king, yeah! Uh, without the plan, we have nothing to show the king! What a disgrace! Gilbert, go get the king and bring him here. I have an idea. Mm. You're looking at the king, yeah! So well done. Congratulations. You won, and we lost. But I was looking at your drawing, and I must say, I'm not sure I understood everything that it said. I don't even think that the king would have understood it. It was so complicated. Mind your own business. My drawing was clear. Mm, well, I didn't understand it. Well, I drew everything clearly, the path of the king, all of it. Ain't that right? Mm -hmm. uh, <sighs> why do I bother? See, I told you. They didn't get it either. They don't get anything. I'm used to it. Okay, fine. I'll show you what I drew. You're gonna feel foolish when you see how clear my drawing was. There you go. It's even clearer than the original. So there's the king. We kidnap him, then send him to the other side of the world. So do you still not get it? Very interesting. Guards. Oh. Oops. Yay! Yay! Ooh, that was close. It's no picnic replacing Maurice. Are you kidding? You were perfect, Patricia. Oh, Gilbert. You're the one who was perfect, as usual. No, you were even more perfect. Yes, Miguel agrees. That's embarrassing. <laughs>